Hi, I'm Peanut. And this is my garden. Welcome. Now we will learn about the garden. So first, let us see what is a garden. A garden is a plant space, usually outdoors, in which grass, flowers, shrubs and vegetables may be grown. Now let's find out what is gardening. Well, gardening is the practice of growing and cultivating plants. A child can learn about science and nature from growing their own food and also create a beautiful environment by growing flowers. This is a healthy and fun activity for children. Look at this picture. Here a girl and a boy are gardening. Now let us find out how to take care of your garden. There is a variety of interesting activities children can do to take care of their garden with the help of their family members like father, ma, grandfather, grandmother, etc. Number 1. Mulch the garden bed soon after planting. Mulch prevents weeds and helps keep moisture in the soil. Note, a mulch is a layer of material applied to the surface of soil. It helps to moisture the soil, improving fertility and health of the soil, reducing weed growth. Number 2. Water your garden regularly with proper quantity so that the top 6 inches of soil remains moist but not soggy. Number 3. Keep plant leaves and flowers dry to save from foliar diseases and fungal problems. Avoid excess watering. Number 4. Pruning or trimming the plants when necessary by cutting away dead or overgrown branches or stems or dry leaves to increase fruitfulness and growth. Number 5. Clean your garden regularly. Keep your garden free of weeds and remove weeds to protect your plants from various diseases. Number 6. Remember to feed your plants as needed. Applying fertilizer to the soil is necessary for your plants to keep them alive and healthy. Number 7. Watch out for pests and fungal diseases. Check your plants weekly for symptoms of diseases or pest problems. Treat them promptly with an appropriate organic pesticide. So those were the basic 7 points of gardening. So let's move on and find out what are the things required for gardening. The things you will need for gardening are soil, seeds, fertilizer, mulch, insecticide or fungicide, watering can, bucket, hand trowel, shovel, hand rake, pruning shears, garden hose, wheelbarrow, garden gloves, garden boots. As you can see in this picture, this is a bag of garden soil. So what exactly is garden soil? Well, garden soil is a top quality soil that has been enriched to make it better suited for plant growth. Next we have seeds. A seed contains a miniature plant called an embryo that can develop into a fully grown plant. The outer shell of the seed called a seed coat protects the embryo. Next we have fertilizer. Fertilizers are materials that can be added to soil or plants in order to provide nutrients and sustain growth. Remember, always use organic fertilizers that are naturally produced. Mulch A mulch is a layer of material applied to the surface of soil. It helps to moisture the soil, improving fertility and health of the soil, reducing weight growth. Then we have insecticide and fungicide. Insecticide and fungicide are substances used to kill insects and harmful fungus. Moving on, we have the watering can. A watering can is a portable container, usually with a handle and a funnel, used to water plants by hand. 
Next we have a garden bucket. A garden bucket is used to store water for plants. Then we will need a pot or planter. A plant pot or planter is a container in which flowers and other plants are cultivated and displayed. The next on our list is a hand trowel. Hand trowels are used for digging the soil and are also used to dig up weeds. Then there is a garden shovel. Garden shovel is an all-around tool useful for digging, transplanting, lifting and all sorts of garden tasks. Then there is the rake. Rake is a metal broom which is used to collect leaves, hay, grass, etc. and also for smoothing loose soil or gravel. Then comes the pruning shears. Pruning shears, also called hand pruners, are a type of scissors which are used for trimming or cutting hard branches of trees and shrubs, sometimes up to 2 cm thick. Then we need a garden hose. Garden hose is a long, flexible tube used to transport water for gardening, lawn care and other landscaping purposes. They are also used for outdoor cleaning. Next we have the wheelbarrow. A wheelbarrow is a small open cart with one wheel and handles that is used for carrying and moving different things from one place to another in the garden. Next is garden gloves. Garden gloves are synthetic or rubber gloves which are worn to protect the gardener's hands from chemicals and various types of oil, pesticides and water solutions that are utilized in the garden. And the last on the list for the day are garden boots. Gardening boots protect your feet and give you comfort while working with your garden or just by walking on the mud and water. Garden boots are made from sturdy materials and are also lightweight, waterproof and easy to clean. Yay! Now you know so much more about my garden. Thank you so much for visiting today. And do not forget to check out our other videos. You will find the links in the description box below. Bye bye for now. See you soon. And if you like our videos, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to our channel Peach Peanut Poppy.